Ladies and gentlemen, drum roll please. This is it. The moment you've been waiting for. So let's hear it for your new Vauxhall Crossland X. Smart, isn't it? And practical too. Bet you can't wait to get better acquainted. Come on then, let's be having you. See that unlock button on your key? Go on, give it a press. Now you're in. It's time to say hello to your new pride and joy. Let's hope the neighbours are looking, eh? They're sure to be impressed by what they see. Assuming you can drag yourself away from your new set of wheels at some point, just press the lock button as you leave. Waving goodbye is optional. Oh, and by the way, if you want to lock the doors from the inside, just use this button here. Your new Crossland X is pretty cool, inside and out. Now you need to get comfy behind the wheel. First, wriggle your bum all the way into the back of the driver's seat. Now remember, the most comfortable position is with your knee slightly bent when you push the brake pedal all the way down. You can slide the seat backwards and forwards by lifting the lever on the left at the front of the seat. And it's the same thing for your arms. Keep them comfortable with a slight bend in the elbows when you're holding the steering wheel. Just adjust the backrest using the wheel down there by your right hip. And you can pump the seat up and down like this. So, if you've done all that and the steering wheel now doesn't seem to be in the right position, you're either sitting in the passenger seat or you need to adjust the steering wheel's position. Just undo the lever underneath the steering wheel and you can move it up, down, nearer or further. Once you've got it right, please don't forget, you've got to put the lever back up. All set? Now for your wing mirrors. You can adjust them by selecting left or right by using this switch and then moving the mirror with these buttons. Up a bit. A little more. Back a bit. There. Perfect. Ah. Transporting kids. Easy if you ignore the noise and sweet wrappers. Find the Isofix mounts at the bottom of the rear outer seat and slot their car seats in place. You'll have them safely tethered in no time. To start your car, remember to press the clutch down when you turn the key. If your car comes with optional open and start, when you get inside just press the start button with the clutch pressed down to fire the engine. If your car is an auto, just keep your foot on the brake while you start the engine. You'll want to keep your new car running smoothly, so here's some practical advice. Want to get under the bonnet? Easy. Pull this lever in the passenger footwell. Then push the catch at the front of the bonnet to the left and lift. And look, no hands. It'll hold itself open. To top up the washer fluid, open this cap and pour to ensure you keep your windscreen immaculate, even in winter. To check your oil, look for the dipstick here and the oil filler cap here. Your owner's manual tells you how to check and refill your oil safely. Make sure you top up when you need to and you'll keep everything running nice and smoothly. Push the fuel flap when the time comes to fill up. It unlocks automatically with the doors and it's all secure when the car is locked. Easy. Your Crossland X may be small on the outside, but it's a veritable TARDIS on the inside. Flip open the boot using the button above the number plate and you'll get a sense of what we mean. Generous, isn't it? Think of all the things you can carry in here. Shopping, sports gear, a good pile of suitcases. And if you need more room, just knock the rear seats down. Pull the lever at the top of the seats and they'll fold flat like this. Or all together, like this. Got a flat tyre? What a pain. But don't worry, just grab the inflation kit from beneath the boot floor and follow the instructions to pump emergency foam into your damaged tyre. Then you'll be good to head to your nearest Vauxhall retailer. They'll sort it out for you, and they might even have coffee. Well, that's you and your shiny new Crossland X well and truly introduced. I've got a feeling this is the start of a beautiful friendship. So let's leave you to it. Have a nice time together. Enjoy your adventures. Au revoir. Adieu. Farewell. Let's check out some of the day-to-day -day features on your new Vauxhall Crossland X. Want the bad news? It's going to get gloomy sometime. We're in the UK after all. But the good news is that your Crossland X's headlights will come on automatically when it does. You can twist the switch to the right of your steering wheel once to use the side lights and twice for dipped beam. Commuting in a P-Super? Turn on your fog lights using the buttons in the centre of the dial to control them. And if it's so dark you need full beam, push the left-hand stalk away from you. You can flash your lights too, just by pulling it towards you. Your indicators? Push this stalk up or down lightly for a few flashes, 
and a little harder to keep them on. Easy. There's just no predicting the Great British weather, but it's OK, because your Crossland X has automatic wipers. Push up the stalk to the right of your steering wheel once to set automatic wipers and let them work their magic. If you need to change the setting, turn this centre bit to increase or decrease wiper speed. Push up the stalk further for constant low speed and up again when it's raining cats and dogs. And by the way, just twist the end of the stalk to control the rear wiper. Easy driving, come rain or shine. And if a bird does the inevitable on your windscreen, pull the stalk towards you to wash it. And push it away to wash the rear screen, so everything's sparkling like new. Chill out, dude. What an awful expression. But at least with your Crossland X's climate control, you really can cool down. Select climate control on the touchscreen and you can operate fan speed, temperature and direction of airflow with your fingertips. Or, if you're a little old school, you can still use these trusty dials to control fan speed. And here's something. There are two temperature controls, so you can have different settings on each side of the car. We're generous like that. It's not just hot days that bring out the best in your climate control. On a chilly day, it's the perfect way to demist your windscreen too. Just use this setting for airflow and turn the fan speed and temperature to maximum. You'll be ready to go in no time. And if the rear screen gets misted up, that's OK too. Just press this button here. It will turn on the heated wing mirrors as well as the heated rear screen. Perfect for chilly starts. Brrr. Ugh, the 50 mile per hour trudge through motorway roadworks. How do you cope during endless miles of traffic cones and abandoned diggers? It's easy. Use your Crossland X's cruise control. Turn it on by pressing the button on the left of your steering wheel. Accelerate up to the speed you want, then just turn the thumb wheel down to set. That's it. You've activated and set cruise control. Enjoy the ride. If you need to, you can then increase or decrease the speed by pushing the thumb wheel up or down. You can put cruise control on standby with a quick dab of the brake, and if you want to reactivate it, just turn the thumb wheel to res. When you want to turn the cruise control off, just press this button. You can do that at any time. Want to know what's going on with your car without getting out of the seat? Your driver's information centre has the answers. Twist the control at the end of the indicator stalk to find everything you need, including oil life, fuel range and tyre pressures. You can view the different menus available by pressing here, and then select the exact section you require by twisting this dial. If any of the lights in your instrument cluster start flashing, don't just ignore them. Make sure you check your owner's manual or contact a Vauxhall retailer.